on the road, hearing the sounds of bottle stones in a pavilion, e cubo. Behind the bamboo curtain shadows are indistinct. Puddle stones rattle across the board like hail after rain has cleared. Skill, great or little, is irrelevant here. The pleasure is in the clinking of the stones. 도중에 누각 뒤에 도중에 누각 위의 바둑 소리 이 교포 발 넘어 사람 그림자 은은히 비치는데 옛날 우박이 바둑판 위에 흩어진다 바둑 수야 높든 말든 알바 아니지만 멀어지는 바둑알 소리가 그럴 듯 하네. 이 규보 is the Korean poet of transcendence. His distinction lies, however, not in any claims to personal transcendence, which in any event would be an arrogance, but in his ability to perceive transcendence in others and to bemoan his own lack of it. A kinder generation would call it humility. Today's poem shows him on the road, feeling a bit left out. A bit homesick. He is on the outside, looking in at the Padu players, wishing wistfully that he was at home, sharing a similar camaraderie with his friends. Padu is the board game with white and black counters. You see, played everywhere. <laughs>